can you help me on the pair trade between ETH and Sol? What is the ratio I need to look at for both? So this is a tricky one as well, because uh, like Solana, for what it does, you know, we started looking at this protocol back in March 2021. First YouTube channel that kind of said, this is probably the ETH killer, um, but it has not done well. Um, and it's way, way undervalued compared to what it was. So let's look at a simple metric. This is from Artemis. Our dashboard is too complex. This is the actual number of daily active addresses on Ethereum and on Solana. Solana is in green, Ethereum is in gray. And you can see that nearly half the time, Solana has actually more active users and is about to be above Ethereum again today or tomorrow. Um, but the crazy thing is, Solana trades at 1 25th the market cap of Ethereum. It does way more transactions. And the people who are active on the chain are a lot more active. And the breadth of dApps is broader, et cetera, et cetera. And this is the crazy thing that's going on. Um, it's mind boggling, but sometimes markets are irrational. People will yellow into meme coins or things that are pumped by influencers that have crap tokenomics and crap compendium scores because the people that hold them, the whales that hold 90% of the bags, need to offload. So they recruit people to pump crap on them. That is the big message today. So be careful out there. But this is silly. You know, bare minimum, it should be one tenth the market cap of ETH. Bare, bare minimum, it's now 125th. So that's just markets. Let's look at the pairs. Now here, you can see the Sol ETH pair is currently at about 0 0.01128. Had a little bit of a bump there. It's hard to say exactly where this king can go because there's no solid trading pattern between both because literally, as I mentioned before, Sol has been bleeding against ETH for the last year with the FTX debacle, etc., etc. It's just been doing bad and it needs to break out and that means it needs to get above 30 bucks and then off to the races and people need to start looking at fundamentals, which they don't do either. So that's kind of maybe a floor for the Sol ETH at, you know, called it 0 0.01089. Now, ETH Sol, you see a little other variance. Oh, by the way, this is the mean version at the bottom. Green is when you typically buy. And we just had a little green flag as well. So that's a positive sign to basically go into Sol here at this level. Now the ETH Sol, which is the inverse, uh, it should be around 60 to 90. That's the range you play. But remember, that will not last forever. That's going to change very radically once the market recognizes the value of Solana, especially with adoption. There's a lot of more good stuff coming, renders, etc. moving onto the chain. So it's gonna drive things bonkers. So we can't specifically find that trading range because Solana's just so beaten down and you don't want to be caught out because gravity will win. Uh, this does not belong down here.